Jack Colbert, the 44 Kenworth. The truck was sold originally in Oregon to a company, a uh, construction company, I guess in 44. They said 217 Kenworths was sold to civilian use, and about a half of them were this model. On account of the war, everything had to go to the war effort. It wound up in Washington State as a collector. And a couple of owners, another guy bought it and run it for a bit. And it was in Nevada in, I think, 83 at a truck show. He took a load of lumber down with him to Sparks, Nevada. Brian Kurtz bought it from Breslau. He bought it. It was out in Washington State then. And I don't know how he completely restored it again. That's his color scheme. And I don't, I don't even know how many years he had it. And he sold it at an auction in uh, B&L Farm Services at Chesley bought it. And they had it a number of years, and then I bought it from them. So that's how I wound up with it. But <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, I, I actually haven't done very little to it. It's the, got to give Brian Kurtz the credit for the way, and he did an excellent job of restoring it. What all's under the hood? HB 160 Cummins and a four and a three transmission. It works good. It doesn't get that much power. I don't you know. You drove how... it here to the show. Oh yeah, right? we drive it, but uh, I don't know how they used to drive and pulling a trailer. To me, it doesn't got hardly enough power to drive itself around. But out in the mountains. Uh, yeah, too. yeah. <laughs> but uh, I guess back in the day, that was uh, that was a big motor. I guess mm -hmm. some more gas pots then. Just just goes to shows. Yeah. Oh yeah. 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 All over the place, or just locally, or. Yeah. Uh, B and L had it to Montreal. It's been it's been to Notre Dame, but I haven't taken it just local shows as far as well, I've got. I've seen it here twice now yeah. in the exact same spot. The exact same Prime spot. parking. Uh, <laughs> actually, Kenworth called me. They wanted to take it down to Ohio this year to the assembly plant. They were having a show there, but just it was just for week. employees. Yeah, mm -hmm. I want to go to a show with a lot of other stuff too. So, mm -hmm. so I didn't bother. But. So, do you drive truck? Yes, I do. Yeah. I drive that Superliner. And was this just a something you always wanted sort of situation? Yeah, you just end up like old trucks and uh, yeah, it's just a toy. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. But your daily driver is a Superliner. Yeah, that Max Superliner down there. Yeah, that's pretty. An eighty-seven. Yeah. So.